Why did you become a teacher? I became a teacher because I used to work at an after school program, a math program with kids on the south side of Chicago and I really liked the program and I liked working with youth so I went back to school and got my degree in education. That's why I became a teacher. If you knew about the school and all the students here acting real crazy, would you have picked this job? <laughs> Um, I think Mission has a lot to offer as far as structure. I think the students are, are all, they're really cool. I think the students are, students everywhere are really interesting. Um, I think Mission is, is a lot of hard work and I think I would have chosen it re regardless of knowing that it was a lot of hard work. But um, I'm hoping that all the work I put in this year will make next year easier and less work for me. What is your accomplishments while you're here working here? My accomplishments. Um, my accomplishments while working here are hopefully by the end of the year we'll see that the juniors GPA and um, the scores will allow them to get scholarships to college. So I, we haven't seen it yet, but hopefully by the spring we'll see the results. Overall, how do you feel about this school? I feel like it's a great place for students and teachers. Uh, again, a lot of work for both students and teachers, but um, it'll help. In the end, it'll help everyone eventually. Right. Teach you about life. Hmm? Oh yeah. Uh, so one of your back in the day stories. <laughs> there were plenty of back in the day stories. <laughs> Had a remote. Which one in particular do you want me to tell you about? Oh, you had so many in this century. <laughs> so many? Yeah, I did. I did. There's so many videos. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you, like, freshmen know. Mm -hmm. If you go to detention, you will hear a back in the day story every single time you go. Yes. Back in the day. My youthful, younger days. I'm still young, Pat Remo. <laughs> Don't get it twisted. Don't ever try me. I won't. <laughs> Y'all know I'm crazy. I got what? A twitch problem? <laughs> I got to take these here cookies right here. Calm me down. Pat a remote. Oh, She's nutter buddy. Those cookies. Best cookie ever made. My nutter buddy. <laughs> and my green tea. Green tea. Alright? Alright. This is what calms me down. Ain't that right? Leverage? You're leverage, oh. yo. That's my son. Uh huh. <laughs> Get the hold of Sal. He's my children. Uh, wave to the camera. Wave, my children. <laughs> Just wave. Don't say nothing. <laughs> All right. I'll see you in silly. Pat Remos. <laughs> what? Love you. Love you. Hey, man. <laughs> Be no more. Be no more. Be no more. Or the score. Score. Score the score. Everybody take the score real quick. Knowledge is power. Remember that. Knowledge is power. Be mindful. Even though, even though, be not, mindful, God. Even though not you and gum might not make us successful, we hope it will one day. <laughs> Why'd you become a teacher? Uh, because I found out that it's something I'm good at. Really? <laughs> Yeah. You want to see my test scores? You really like teaching these kids? Uh, sometimes. Really? Sometimes. Is going to be your answer? Yeah, when you guys do what you're supposed to, when you participate like you're supposed to, it's fun. But when you guys slack off and try to do other things and be sneaky and do other homework and all that kind of stuff, it's irritating and that's what bothers me. Okay, yeah. you're just referring to me, aren't you? Oh my gosh. <laughs> See, now you know how it feels. Okay. All right. Um, if you knew about the school and the students, would you have be, would you work here? I do work here. No, I mean, like, would you work here if you knew before? That's why I worked here because I knew I had former students that went here fresh, their freshman year who are now juniors, and they told me about this place, so I wanted to work here. Yep. All right. What are your accomplishments for these students? What are my accomplishments? Yeah. Two, over two points growth in reading, almost four points growth in English last year for you guys, your juniors now. Um, I don't know, test scores and stuff like that. 
prayer. Yes. yes. Should we remain to? Yes. Yes. On your birthday? Yes. What's up? What, what is that? Yeah. Turn around. Hey, no. Jamie. I want to call hey. me like oh, my big bag, so. No, man. Big bag. <laughs> 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 Charlie, you want to give a shout out to me, Sean? I want to give a shout out to me, Sean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah. What are the units that you're starting with? So, Ms. Critchfield, why did you become a teacher? I became a teacher because, um, well, it wasn't until I was in college that I decided I wanted to be a teacher. If you had asked in high school if I wanted to, I would have said no. Um, but once I was in college, the classes that I liked the most were my English classes, and I liked the fact that we got to discuss and got to talk a lot about deeper things and the meanings and stuff. And then I started to think, once I was out of college a little bit, and went back with some perspective, that how fun would it be to be the person who picked the things that high schoolers got to read and talk about. So that was when I changed my mind and that was why. If you knew all about these snot nose kids, would you have picked the school? I don't see anyone with snot, but also, um, the kids at this school are the best kids. Um, seriously, I've taught in three high schools. Um, and the kids are the best part of the job, by far. Really? So yeah. You like being a teacher? I love being a teacher. Are you sure? I'm positive. Alright. You're still here. You're still here? <laughs> I know. Alright. Okay. Bye, Miss Kitchfield. Bye. They're saying, wait, wait, breaking news, breaking news, wait. We have an important guest here today. Rosa Parks. Oh my gosh. Here we go. So, the scoop of Rosa Parks on the bus is here today. Okay? Now we're here. Go and talk to Rosa Parks with they're talking to me. Oh my gosh. Anywho, back to this. Back to you, Jenny.